Heat waves are hitting Canadians hard this summer from coast to coast to coast. Now new research shows they were made more likely because of climate change. Our analysis for this past summer looked at heat waves across Canada. Heat waves when daily temperatures shot well above the regional average. Most were made more likely by climate change. The strongest heat wave they looked at was in Atlantic Canada, where temperatures soared beyond what's typical in August, and that one was made 10 times more likely because of global warming. Research like this models a world without climate change and lets scientists figure out how much of an impact it's having. Some of that is natural, but climate change is loading the dice. In another new study, the U.S. nonprofit Climate Central looked at days where temperatures also soared above what's typical and found that Canadians went through 39 risky heat days. We defined risky heat as being heat that is hotter than 90% of the temperatures you typically experience in your local area. And Canadians went through two more weeks of those risky heat days because of climate change. The big mis- message here is clear. Climate change is reshaping the odds of daily weather in Canada. And people feel it most directly through extreme heat. The greatest risk of extreme heat is for seniors, children, and people on medication or who have underlying health concerns. But it's also dangerous for anyone forced to stay in that heat. What is their ability to adapt in this situation? Uh, And that includes having air conditioning, having a job where even if they're in the heat, are able to get out of the heat through policies that protect outdoor workers. And as the world burns more fossil fuels adding to climate change, it means the chances of these multiple heatwave summers could go from rare to regular. Anand Ram, CBC News, Toronto.